All right, in a nice cool, I might have to take a little moment's break um, when my husband goes to bring my doggy. And Lauren, I'm using you next time. I didn't think of it, sorry. Um, to, the, to the vet, turn their shoulders forward. Four more. Now let's rotate, pivot side to side, just turning your body. That's it. Add a little punch out. A little punch out, four more. Three, two, one, take a breath in, bring the arms up, hinge forward, stretch it back. Take your palms together, head down, arms up, knees are bent, as bent as you need them to be. And just walk them out a little bit. I know that we're gonna get warm really quickly today. Uh, at least I hope so. And then bring your arms down, slow the legs, bring the hands to the floor or to the foot. Bend your knees, drop your hips, and just maybe move it a little side to side with a little pit bull, it makes you move. And then straighten the legs, walk down, walk your hands only halfway out, and then press your heels down towards the floor, right arm to left foot, shin or ankle. Look under your arm. Switch sides. Twist and hold. And walk it back to center. Step your feet back, high plank, top of a push-up. Now you all know a plank. Hips up in the air, down dog. This time, hinge forward all the way, drop your hips towards the floor, lift your heart up. Shoulders back and down. Stretch the front of your chest and shoulders and the abs. One more time, downward dog. Good, right foot forward. Right knee down, arm up, open twist. Good, I don't know, is that Cindy? Good morning, whoever's there. Arm down, downward facing dog. Left leg forward, right knee down. Open twist. Three, two, now take it down. Straighten the back leg, step it on the outside of the right hand. Open up your hips with your hands inside. Swing it a little side to side. And then place your hands on top of your thighs. Pull your belly in round and curl. Arch your back, dip your belly, broaden your collarbones. Let's do that one more time, round and curl. And release it. This time round it all the way up. Walk it in heel and toe and shake it out, good. All right, we're gonna start with a squat and a row. So you're gonna come down, squat, row, and stand all the way up, okay? So we're, while we're down there, we're gonna do our rows, take it to two heavy weights if possible, and we're gonna get ourselves started. Sure, thank you for telling me. All right, there you go. Better, right? All right, squat and row. We're doing 15 reps. Three, two, let's go. One, row, come on up. Two, weight in your heels, come on up. Three, four, keep your knees apart. Five, if you're wearing a band, keep your legs against the band so there's resistance on the outside. Six, seven, halfway there, eight, nine, hang in there, ten, five more, five, four, three, Two more. One more. That's it. Stand all the way up. Good. Next exercise. Alternating legs with a lunge. A hammer open and down. Alternating for 16 reps. All right, so we've got a hammer open. Moderate to heavier wor um, uh, weights are good. All right, pick them up. We go in four. Three, two, here we go, right first. One, open, and back, two. 
If you're not lunging, just step back. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight more, eight, Seven, uh -huh. eight, oh, six, five. <laughs> That's what happens when you get hooked into the music. Four, little Taylor Swift. Three, two more times. Two, and one more. Awesome. Good, put it down. Take a little stretch. Deadlift, so next. Deadlift, right into a bicep curl. So yeah, see, it got warm already. I think Cindy was smart, she started without the sweatshirt. All right, I knew it would happen. All right, deadlift bicep curl, 15 of them. Ready, three, two, let's go. One, and bring it up for a curl. Two, weight back in your heels. Three, mm -hmm. four, five, good stretch on the hamstrings. Six, a slight bend to the knees, so it's not a squat. Seven, you're halfway through. Six, sit up, good. Nine, ten, five more, four more, three, good stretch guys, two, good, don't round your back, one more time, and all the way up, good, put it down, Shake it off. And that's how I work that in there. All right, second set. We're only doing two sets today, but we have 15 reps of everything. So, we're back to our squat with rows. You did a first set, so notice if you need to do a heavier or lighter set of weights for the next one. All right, pick up your weights when you're ready. Bend your knees to get there. Bend over rows with a squat. Four, three, two, go. Squat row and up one squat row and up two good squat three four keep the weight back five six seven eight Halfway. Nine. Ten. Good. Feel the weight in your heels. Five more. Four. Uh huh. Three. Two more. Last one. Good. Take a short break. Brakes are good, put your weights down, we're not there that long. Alternating legs with a hammer, open shirt. All right, pick up your weights. You got three. Where's my work? Oh, it didn't pick up. Two, one, right leg back. Hammer, open, return. Two. Three, four, uh-huh, five, six, notice if you need to change weights, or hang in there, seven, halfway, eight, nine, two, ten, five, no, six, five, four, 
three, last two, two, oh yeah, feel those arms, one, and down. All right, last set in this circuit, deadlift to bicep curls, uh, moderate to heavy. So who was talking about getting heavier weights? Oh, Debbie the other day. There's weights in CVS, guys, Target, Walmart, all over the internet. So if you need heavier weights, this is a good time to get them. All right, they are out there. Pick up your weights, bend your knees, deadlift, three, two, let's go. One, with a bicep curl, all the way up. Two, all the way up. Three, four, five, six, so slow on the way down for success, seven, eight, nine, 10, good, slow and controlled on the way down. Five, four, three, two more. One more time. Awesome, put the weights down. All right, so we're gonna be moving into another Set. We're going to be doing a clean and press without a squat. So we're going to clean shoulder press overhead. So you may want to go with a lighter set of weights. Feel how you kind of see how you're feeling. We got 15 of those with two arms. So be careful that you um, you don't swing your back to get the weights up. If you have to hinge from your hips a little bit and get that little bit like you're doing a squat, almost pushing down from the ground up. And then we'll see what's next. All right. Two arms, clean to your shoulders and press overhead. Three, two, go. One, press. Now, you can have your palms in any direction. You can turn them in, you turn them up. Three, four, right? All sorts of different ways. So pick what's good for you, five, six, Seven, good, eight, nine, ten, last five. So I'm hinging, I'm using my hips to push up rather than my lower back to swing. Three, two more, one more. Thanks for coming down. And down. Good. Now we need one weight, moderate to heavy, because this one does have a little bit of momentum to drive the weight overhead. It's a snatch. Just call it what it is. We're going to pick it up. And, I'm sorry. We're going to go straight up to the ceiling. Straight up to the ceiling. Okay? Other hand off your body. Moderate weight. Try it. If you can, if you can adjust it, because again, you can get a little bit of momentum in there. We got 15 on the right side. Three, two, go. One, two, straight up. Three, four, five. Nice, Laura. Yes, everybody. Six, seven. A little bit more in the hip than the, hip, than the back. Eight, nine, ten. So try not to bring... Bend your torso, rather bend your hips. Four, three, and get low. Two, one more. Switch sides. All right, roll your shoulder out. Four, three, two, go. One, two. So again, try not to bend this way. Don't hinge from your hips, four. Do it from a little bit of a squatting position. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, five more, five, 
four, three, it's that pause at the top, two, one more, ooh, put it down. All right, so it's momentum and you stick it, right? Get a little bit of that um, stability through the shoulder. Two weights, clean and press. So change your weights if you need to, but you got two of them now. All right, any way you want your shoulders to be, palms in, palms open, combination of both. In four, three, we got 15. Two, here we go. One, press. Two, remember if you're gonna do any work from the back, make it from the butt, not your back. Three, four, five, six, seven, good, don't pooch out your ribs, eight, nine, ten, six, uh, five more, five, four, hang on, three, two more, one more. Ooh. We have to censor this song, I guess. All right. Back to a single weight. So you just did this, you know. Was it challenging? Was it not challenging enough? If you have um, only light weights, put two in one hand. Get a good grip, grip on it only if you can get a good grip on it. All right. Single arm snatch. Right leg, right arm first. Three, two, let's go. One, two, so keep your torso higher, Joe. Three, four, hinge from your hips, not your, yeah. Five, so think like you're gonna go into squat. Six, that's it. Seven, eight, good. Nine, five more, six more. Six, five, four, stick it, three, Two more, one more, woo, bring it down. Roll your shoulders. All right, right shoulder anyway. Other side, four, three, two, go. 15, two, three, good, four, there you go. Five, six, seven, Eight, nine, five more, five, four, three, two more, one more, ah, let it go. Good job, guys. All right, take a little water break. My watch is just not behaving with me this morning. All right, all right. Now we do have a hip hinge. It's gonna be with weight. Hinge arms back, stand up, hammer it. Now also when you stand up, come on your toes. Hinge up, right? Then we're gonna have a plie with a tricep put, a press up. All right, moderate to heavier weights. Weights, all right, 15. In four, three, two, go. Hinge up, I didn't go on my toes. Two, three, four, five. This is momentum again. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five more, four, three, two, and one. That's it. Piece of cake. All right. One weight, two hands. So see if you can go to a heavier weight. Wide-legged plie tricep. So you've got, actually, we're going to put our weight in our hands in front of the chest. We're going to go down, up, down. That's one. All right? So picking up from the center of your body. 
Two hands, one weight, three, two, go. Down, up, down, one. Down, up, two. Press up, three, four, keep going, five, good, six, seven, perfect everybody, eight, nine, ten, five, four, three, two more, one more, and up and back, nice work, okay, so our next exercise, if you have a barbell, it's always a little bit easier with a barbell, uh, you could try with a weight, I'm going to do it weightless, hands are behind the head, we've done these before, they're good mornings, so again, it's a hinge, we get parallel to the floor with our torso, but on this one, when we come up, we do an alternating knee. So, you're bending over, then you stand up and rotate your torso. All right, if you wanna try it with weights behind your head or hit one heavy weight behind your head, if you have a barbell, might work better. Just don't crank your neck in it. Four, three, two, here we go. One, there's 16, twist, two, twist, three, that's it, four, you got it, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten, oops, six more, six, five, four, three, two, last one, and up, good, all right, easy peasy, we're back to the hinging arms, hammer curl, on your toes. Final set of this. Bend your knees to pick up your weights always. Second set. Four, three, I'll wait for you all to get there. Two, let's go. Hinge forward, curl on your toes. Two, three, four abs tight. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five, four, three, two more, one more, and done. Easy peasy. All right, we're gonna hold on to one weight. Wide-legged plie into a tricep. It's a press and a tricep. All right, hold on to your weight. Hold it in the center, you can hold the weight in either direction, whatever it really speaks to you. All right? Wide leg, four, three, two, let's go. I'm gonna do this. Down, up, one. Down, two. Three. Four. Five, elbows by your ears. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five, four, three, two more. Last one. Good, and done. So if you used weights last time, go ahead and grab the weights for your good morning, alternating knee twist. Hands behind your head. 
knees are soft, body goes parallel to the floor, unless for some reason, you know, this is affecting your back too much, okay? And if that's the case, just do twists, all right? In four, three, two, go. Bend forward, hinge forward, twist one. Hinge, twist two. Hinge, three, outside the knee. Four, five, six, seven, eight, eight more, seven, six, keep the roundness out of your back by looking forward, five, four, three, two, one more, ah, oh, and done. Good. Grab some water. Moving on. We've got one more standing set and then we're done. So, um, those of you who are using or want to use a band, on the second exercise, you can actually put it on for the first. Get ready with uh, one arm. So this one is going to be a squat clean press, but we're going to rotate on the press. So the leg that's, uh, of the arm that's holding the weight is going to turn, okay? So see if you want to go with a moderate or heavier weight. You choose. I'm going to start off light. It's a squat, shoulder press, clean overhead. So we've done like all of those together today or separately today. Now we put it together with a little rotation. Right arm for four, in four, three, two, it's a squat. Squat, press, rotate again. Two, press, rotate. Three, press, rotate. Four, press, rotate. Five, good. Six. Seven. Halfway there, guys. Eight. Nine. Remember, this one's a, a squat. Ten. Five more. Five. We get to do the other side yet. Four. Three. Two more. One more, and that's it, good, other side. Squat, so this one's a squat, you can get your hips dropped down. Four, three, two, let's go. Squat, press, rotate, one, two, three, four, Good, right arm is free. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, six more. Six, five, this will help your shoulders to hold up the turkey tomorrow. Three, two, one more, and done. All right, you may choose to use a lighter set of weights. If you're using a band, take it either above your knees or around your ankles. Either one, they're both right. As long as they're not on your knees. You're gonna sit down low. We're gonna do a side raise with a tap. The only thing is, we're not straightening our legs in between. We stay in that low seated position for the 16 reps. All right, so it'll be 16 times with your arms and side to side with your legs. All right, eight times on each side. So feet are apart, neutral. Squat down low, arms in front. Three, two, tap side. One, two, the lowest you can sit for you, four, five, 
six, don't move anything else, seven, oh, we got a time to show, eight, keep going, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, stand up. Good, put those weights down. Second and last time, squat, clean, rotate, press. Ready, pick up your weight. Legs are hips width apart. Three, two, go. Squat, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this one again, keep your torso a little bit more up. Use your hips. 11, 12, 13, two more. One more. And we switch sides, <clears throat> excuse me. All right, left hand holds the weight. In four, three, two, go. Squat, press, rotate one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, five more, five, four, three, two more, last one, awesome, good job guys. All right, last time for the side raise and side tap. Staying low, keeping it nice and low. All right, pick up your weights. Whatever weight you choose to work with. Bands on, bands off. Separate your legs. Sit low. Three, two, side to side. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight more, eight, seven, can you sit lower? Six, five, four, I think I'm in the wrong leg, three, two, and one. Come on up. Nice job, guys. Okay, get your mats to the floor. Take your weights, your water, your towel with you. Keep it going. We're almost there. You're good, you're good. All right. So we've got um, a couple of different things going on on the floor. We'll be doing some dedicated abdominal and core, as well as chest and triceps. All right. Let's see if I have enough space here. Take your weights with you. First set is a chest fly, so adjust your cameras for me. And Michelle, you'll let me know if you can't see me, right? Can you see me, oh, everybody good? So your first set, and you'll choose what you wanna do with your legs, is a chest fly, bring your hands together, skull crusher. So it's a fly, skull crusher. So there's two exercises per rep. We've got 15. If you'd like to be in a bridge, hold the bridge, or go up and down or if you'd like to be in tabletop, feet on the floor, or in the air, on your backs, palms together, my legs are gonna be up in tabletop, ribs down, belly in, three, 
two, let's go. Open fly, crush your skull, don't really. One, two, slow and controlled, three, so really feel your abdominals pulling in so that your ribs and your belly or your ribs and your hips try to meet in the center and you don't have that arching in your lower back. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Five more. Four. Three. Two more, please. And one more. And we're up. All right, take it back. Arms behind you, stretch it out. Next exercise is a chest press to a close grip chest press. So traditional chest press, you'll bring your arms down. When they come back up, you'll turn your palms together and come by your rib cage. So we'll get a little more tricep in there as well. Down, up, all right? So moderate heavy weights on your back. Same thing with the legs, your choice. Three, arms are together, two, one. So bring it down, then bring them together and just you know, go right by the rib cage. Two, chest press, rib cage. Three, rib cage. Four, five, six, Seven. So as I press the weight up, I rotate my shoulder. Nine. Ten, you should feel a little bit in that tricep. Five. Four. Three. Two more. And your shoulders, by the way. And one more. We did a lot of shoulder work today. So you're gonna have nice, strong shoulders tomorrow. And one, good. Put your weights down. You can put one weight on your pelvis. We're gonna come into a bridge and we're gonna walk our feet forward and back, alternating the lead leg. So you start with your right leg first time, you start with your left leg the second time. Weight on the pelvis for those of you who want. If you want your arms in the air with a weight or without a weight, that's up to you, okay? Depends on if you want more load or not. I'm gonna keep my arms up so my shoulders press into the earth. Tilt the pelvis, lift your hips up. So get your nice long line. Don't turn your head, I'm just looking to look at you. All right, step forward, right, left. One, one, in, that's one. Two, good. Three, alternating lead legs, four, you got five, six. What's gonna happen, seven, is that you're gonna start eight, sinking your hips as you go forward and back, so readjust, nine, 10, one, two, three, four, Five, and one more, six, and hips down, knees into your chest. All right, let's take a little spinal twist, release that a little bit, and switch your other sides. All right, good job. Second and final set of the chest press. This one is fly to skull crusher, all right? On your back, arms up. You do what you want with your legs and your lower body. It's up to you. Good, four, three, two, one. 
three, two, one, open. One, shul, uh, uh, skull crusher, one, two. So you open from the shoulders, you bend from the elbows. Four. Five, <clears throat> slow down on the uh, fly. Six, take care of those shoulders. Seven, eight, nine, ten. I suspect you're going to feel this one too. Five. Four, three, two more, please. One more. And come on up. All right, big stretch. <clears throat> we got our second set of chest press to close grip. So it's just a traditional chest press wide into a close grip chest press arms rubbed by your rib cage like a chaturanga. All right, on your backs. Arms up, three, two, go. One, close grip, together. Two. Three. Think about your abdominals. Four, don't pooch out, so don't arch your back. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hang in there, guys. Five more. Five, four. Couple more. Three, two, now those shoulders. One, uh, and bring it down. Okay, put your weights up to the side. You don't need them unless you're using one for um, your weight on your pelvis for the bridge. All right, so heels in line with your sitting bones. Arms up, down, whatever you're doing. I just like mine up so I kind of press my shoulders down and I have a little bit of um, stability. Tilt your pelvis, lift your hips up. Start walking forward and back, go. One, two, three. Remember we're switching lead legs, four, five, six, seven, doesn't have to be wide. Eight, just a little bit. Nine, ten, last six, let's go. Six, five, readjust your hips if they're gonna fall. Four, they will fall. Three, two, and one more. And take it down. Ah, uh, hug your knees in. Big stretch for the lower back. Once again, let's take a little spinal twist. All right. Switch sides. All right, so here's what we're going for. This is our probably last set. We're gonna do one, two bicycle, one, two straight leg. One, two bicycle, one, two straight leg. Two bicycles, two straight leg per set. Okay, so all that is one rep. We got 15 of those. All right, ready, set, on your back. Knees over hips, four, three, let's go. Bicycle, bicycle, straight, that's one. Bicycle, bicycle, straight, that's two. Three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten, that's eleven, good, four more, twelve, Thirteen, oh my, twist, twist, fourteen, last one coming up, bend, bend, straight, straight, and hug. Ooh, let me change the music so you don't go to sleep on me. You guys stay out there. You're not done yet. You're not done just yet. All right, let me get you something a little bit more exciting. And, oh, let's, let's do this. I just threw this together last night. All right. All right, now, bend your knees, put your feet on the floor. Hands behind your head. Do not crank your neck. Bend your knees. We're gonna take our arms over to the right side and back down for 15. So just right side only, ready? Three, two, one, let's go. One. Options, two, lift the leg up if you want, three, four, so the right leg can lift up, five, six, it can also straighten, seven, we're staying kind of on this side, eight, nine, ten, five more, five, four, leg down or up, three, two, one more, rest through center, same thing, other side. I'll just flip it around for those of you who need to see it. Hands behind your head, go. 15, 14. So the option may be lift the leg, keep it up, or take it up and down. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more. Five, four, Three, I feel it already. Two more. One more. Good. On that one, guys, it's a crunch, but there's a little bit of a, like you're almost leaning all the way over to your right side, but you're not collapsing, okay? So you've got a little bit more resistance going on. All right, final set. Single, single, straight, straight. Or bent, bent, straight, straight. All right, last time. On your backs, knees up in line with your hips or over your hips. Three, two, here we go. One, one, straight, straight. Two, if you don't wanna do the straight leg or you don't wanna do the bent leg, switch, right? Four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, good, ten. So the upper body keeps doing the same thing. It's the lower body that, eleven, that changes, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, one more time, 15, and done. Bring the knees in. I think you're feeling that, because I'm, I'm feeling it. <laughs> Feet on the floor, hands behind the head. Now, lift your head and shoulders up, then lean a little bit right, but keep your left hip connected, and then lift up and bend to the side. Three, two, one, let's go. 15, 14, 13, 12, if you want the leg up, it's the leg of the side that you're working. Nine, eight, you can take it up and down. Seven, six, you really want to get on the outside of that leg. Five, four, three, two, and one. Ooh, stretch through center, other side. Good, tilt your pelvis, lift your shoulders and head. 
knee to the left and go 15, 14. You choose if you want a leg up or up and down, 12, 11, or down, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, two more times please, one more time, Woo. stretch it out, all right, let's flip over onto our bellies and come into a cobra stretch, ah. Hands by your chest, lift up, low cobra, hips are still on the floor, shoulders down, oh, big stretch in the front body. And then push your hips to your heels, child's pose. Here comes the pupper. And then come back up, and now with your knees down on the floor, toes tuck, just drop your hips down, lift your heart up. Stretch through the front hip, shoulders, chest, abdominal. And then push back to your heels, tuck your toes. And once again, just like we did in the beginning of class, right foot forward. Right hand up twist. Big stretch in the hip flexors. If you're running a race tomorrow, get some good stretching in today. And of course tomorrow. Hand down, straighten your front leg and fold. And then re-bend the front knee. Step back, left leg comes forward. Right hand comes down, left arm opens up, twist. Arm down, straighten the front leg. So Friday's class will be at nine. I will not have any video opportunities until I get back from wherever I'm going. Bend your knee. But if you need it, I'll just let me know and I'll, I'll do the Zoom video and send it out. Tuck your toes, downward facing dog, hips up. Bend your knees, walk it together. I'm going to come face forward. Take your hands behind your back. Interlace your fingers, arms up over your head. Let it go. Chin to chest as you roll slowly through your spine. Keep your arms together. Knuckles down, chest up one more time. Big stretch front of the body. Inhale the arms up. Stretch the arms overhead. Lean to the right side. Inhale, center, other side. Come back to center. Hands one more time behind your head. Just stretch, lift your eye gaze up, lift your chest up. And then release the arms down. Take a big breath in, everybody. And a big breath of gratitude. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. If you're home, stay home, stay fit, stay healthy, and get vaccinated. Happy Thanksgiving.